what we want to do is uh, again we want to figure out that total and make this a little bit larger we want to figure out that total so we look across this way to find this total okay so what we have to do we have to take those numbers and i'm just going to start from left to right take four add it to two add it to six and add it to 14. If we add all those up, we get our um, our total. Okay. And again, we don't have to, you know, we don't have to do these in our head. We can use a calculator. Four plus two plus six plus fourteen. So we get twenty-six when we add those. Hopefully everybody saw that. Text box, boom, right here. Twenty-six. Many six. Okay. And then we go to the next, the next row, which is girls. And again, go all the way across, add the numbers that I come across to find the total. So that means I need to take the 12, add it with the 6, add it with the 3, add it with the last 6. Okay. Um, so I'm going to go back to my calculator. 12 plus 6 plus 3 plus 6. Hit enter. And we get 27. So 27 is the total there. So let me clean it up a little. Let me guess and see. Um, okay. So now we're done with the rows and we need to focus on the columns now. So we need to focus on how do you go down. So luckily these numbers are kind of small. So I'm not going to pull my calculator out and I'm not going to rewrite them. I'm just going to put down here, 4 plus 12 is 16, okay? 2 plus 6 is 8. 6 plus 3, no evidence. 14 and 6, well, that one might use a calculator, but I got you 20, okay? So that was all my totals for the columns. And then remember um, this last box, this last box is special, it's the two for one special, because we can solve that guy two different ways and we get the same one answer, okay? I'm gonna take and add 26 and 27, because that's only two numbers. That's 53. Okay, so I know in here, my total is 53. But you know what? I will show you. Let me, uh, let me write the total down on my paper. I'll show you that you get the same thing if you add uh, going across the bottom. Okay. So if we go across the bottom, I'm going to add these numbers. I'm going to show you we get 53. So we just got 53 with those two. And then my numbers across the bottom are 16, 8, 9, and 20. There it is. 53 twice. Okay, that's why that, that is the two for one special because we can add it two different ways and get the one answer. And now we're done. We're done with completing the two way table. Next, we have to answer these questions. Question one How many people were asked all together? That's, that's our two for one special. That's like how many people were asked total? One of the ways we can find that is, uh, Mr. Davis, I brought this up before, is if we go through and add all of these. Okay. If you add all of them, you should get that number, 53. So that is my answer to this question. Okay. Um, 53 people were asked all together. 53 people. Okay. I'm going to save some of this. And then if we look at our next one, then the next one is how many people enjoy the PE the best? So here's, here's PE, and then you have 14 and 6. Well, 14 is bigger than 6, so these this group enjoyed it the most. And if you look at this one, typical boys. Boys enjoy PE the most, right? Girls don't like to run, 
whatever they do. But I guess some of them do, because some of them did answer that. So boys, how many people enjoyed the pee? Oh, you know what? I, I answered that wrong. I answered that wrong. It's not asking which group liked it the most. It's just how many people enjoyed it the best. So here's my bad. Uh, four and six, 14 and six, 20 people enjoyed that the most. I don't know what I was thinking. 20 people. That's how many people enjoyed PE the most. Okay. Um, so let me erase that. And how many girls like dark? Okay, let's look. These are our two keywords, girls and art. So here's art, here's girls. They intersect there at six. Six girls like dark. Okay. Six girls. Oh, here, hold on. D. Six girls. All right, there it is. And we'll work down with number two. 